Yo, what is up, everybody? This is Ryan, and DMG's here, and uh, another member of the community, Nick. So, we are going to be bringing you uh, Rec Deck Thursday. Well, I'll be bringing you Rec Deck Thursday. And sorry if this uh, gets cut off. I don't know. The hypercam seems to, like... It's glitchy. Yeah, it doesn't, like... This, the picture and the sound don't ever go together. If somebody can tell me how to fix that, um, yeah, please give me some help. Because it's probably going to cut off at the end. If it does, I apologize in advance. Um, first thing before we get into Rec Deck, uh, DMG's happy because oh Shonen Jump God. is releasing <laughs> Slife of the Sky Dragon. and I don't even care if it don't come out English. I'm going to have to get my all hands All that on stuff. That. So that's cool. If you want to check that out, Cyber Knight has it up. and um, It's got its second ad ability, folks. That's yeah, I'm all not that I'm not sure. You can probably check it out on the Shonen Jump website as well. Um, okay, to the deck. I know a lot of people have been asking for ice barriers. Don't worry, I have one built, I believe. Yeah. Where is it? Uh, it might not be on this one. But it is built. Oh, and, we have um, it somewhere. That is not this week's this week's reptile, so that's freaking funny as hell because they're awesome. Okay, lion alligator. Basically, <laughs> if there's what? another reptile on the field, he does piercing. I mean, he's 1900. He can uh, get you over a Thunder King in a pinch if you need to do that. But uh, usually you're just going to have him out there and just uh, attacking hard. Um, this guy, I'm not even going to try to butcher that name. Um, can't be normal summoned or set. When you normal summon a monster, a.k.a. Lion Alligator, you can special summon him. And then you can just succeed right into your fours. Uh, that's that's what I always thing. do for him. Then it goes into the Reptilnias. Uh, these things are funny as anything. Uh, three Reptilian Gardeners, basically your searcher. Get one Reptilian from your deck to your hand. 2,000 wall, so he can stay on the field. Uh, it's funny to see people ram Thunder King into this, and then uh, you can just kill over it with a lion alligator or something. It's, it's pretty funny. Or even summon into a, a big guy. I'll show you later. Uh, two Reptilian Gorgon. Um, if this card attacks an uh, opponent's monster, after the damage calculation, the attack of that monster becomes zero and cannot change the battle position. 1,400, not that big of a monster, but... Uh, the, the zero attack is big and taking control of monsters and stuff. Um, Reptilian Naga can't be destroyed by battle. Anything that battles this card becomes zero, but he gets changed to uh, attack position at the end of the phase. So it's good and it's bad at the same time because he got zero attack. Just be careful if you're using him. Reptilian Skill, another 1800. He's a good beater. Um, if he destroys a monster with zero attack, you can special summon one from the graveyard, so it's good for exceeding. And uh, recycling your Reptilian Garden is for the search. Um, here's your main tuner. It's Reptilian Viper. Um, if he's normal summoned, you can take control of one face of monster with uh, zero attack. So usually I ram it with a Reptilian Gorgon in the next turn. Normal summon the Viper and uh, go from there. Uh, I actually won a duel on here by summoning Reptilian Viper and taking control of a Relinquished. And uh, winning with that, it was, it was really funny. He was um, Reptilian Medusa. Send one card from your hand to the graveyard and select one face of uh, monster your opponent controls, and it becomes zero. Um, he's a good six-star target. He helps you with Reptilian Garna if you're having a Reptilian Garna on the field and they're running like Thunder Kings and stuff. Awesome card. Here's your other main beater, Spawn Alligator. Uh, 2,200, five stars. He, when he's normal summoned by uh, tributing a Reptile, you can target the monster that was attributed uh, and bring it back at the end phase. So, usually Lion and Alligator, it's good to, to do that, so then you can do Piercing. And then I won one Bite to Leon. Uh, he's a huge attack, basically, 2400, does Piercing, and uh, I don't, he's just good. He's just 2400. You gotta watch out for Stardust in this deck, that's why you run your, your um, Reptilian Vipers and these not gonna butcher Kogakatosh. Uh good to exceed. You gotta stop Stardust basically guys. Um Dark Hole, Book of Moon, Heavy, Reborn, Double Forbidden Lance. Um you could take these out. I'm not sure what else you would run in place of this. Maybe your Psalms if you have them. But the Forbidden Lances are good, drop the attack, then you can actually beat over them with Gorgon. Two smashing ground just to remove stuff. Uh, three enemy controller. It's so funny because you can stall out with it with Fratillion Naga, 
and uh, it's just a good car. Another stall car, of course, two swords of revealing light. 